This is David, WA901Y. We're going to talk about the Volkbang UV5R. It's a tenant connector and the adapters that I use in my ham shack. Volkbang comes with a SMA male. There's the pin and the MSA male socket on the transceiver. The antenna has a SMA female. If we want to connect another type of antenna to this, for example, as a SMA male, we'll need a SMA female to SMA female adapter. And that's what we have down here, this little thing here. We can see that there's holes on both sides of the adapter. We screw that in to the transceiver body and attach the SS SMA cable with the male connector. And now that's off into my ham shot connected to various things like test equipment. I have a scanner antenna outside that goes from 30 megahertz up to a gigahertz. And that has RG6 with a F connector. So that's why I would need a SMA female to a F female connector. And that adapts that scanner antenna to use it for FM reception and general purpose. Also, I have equipment that has a BNC. So here's a BNC female to the BNC, excuse me, to the SMA female. That's another adapter here. For the satellite system, I use a very low loss, uh, large cable, and that has end connectors on it. And the end connector is a male on that cable, so I need a end connector female to a SMA female. Finally, there's still some things in the hand shack that has a UHF connector, which is kind of a misnomer. Uh, really doesn't uh, perform well in the high frequencies because it doesn't have controlled impedance across the connector, like the SMA and BNC and the end connector. But I do have some antennas with that, like a tri-bander and so forth. So again, on one side is the SMA female adapter to screw in to the radio. And then this is a UHF, also called a PL259 uh, connector, and that takes the coaxial cable, um, which may be RG8 or it could be um, RG8X, a smaller type of cable. This is David, W-A-9-O-N-Y, 73, and QRT.